In this video, we'll show you how to place a piece of equipment in the drawing. From the left hand side toolbox, select the equipment tab and choose any symbol, for example an exchanger. The symbol can be scaled at the time of placing. You make a box selection of the equipment in order to move it. Next, we will add some process lines to the exchanger. In the toolbox, select the process line tab and select the primary line and start drawing from the exchanger's nozzle. You will notice a nozzle will be automatically placed. Draw another line starting from the exchanger's body. When we move the equipment, all lines and inline components will move along with it. Instead of making a box selection of the equipment, you can also click the symbol itself and drag the blue dot to move it around. Let's add some more process lines. Process lines will by default place a nozzle to the equipment. In some cases, the equipment symbol already has nozzles on it so the auto nozzle is not necessary. To change the nozzle on the equipment, go to the fittings icon on the top ribbon and select change nozzle from the drop down. Now select the nozzle in the drawing and change the nozzle type. To add inline components to the lines, such as valves, access the valve tab from the toolbox and place them on the lines, where they will snap into place. To change the valve type, click on the valve icon on the top ribbon and select Change Valve from the drop down. Select the valve to change and a change valve dialog box will appear. You can see all different types of valves and their previews on the right side when you select them. 